Hold on a second. Didn't we just say that each carbon atom has to have a total of four bonds? Yes, we did. That's true, and it's correct. Each carbon atom has to have four bonds. But if we just took one hydrogen off of each molecule, and those hydrogen atoms must have come off of a carbon atom, then what happens next? Well, because your carbons are always in our phosphate pool and mixed in with all those other yellow blocks we had earlier in the instructional video, you will have inorganic phosphates attaching to the other end of your glyceraldehyde 3-phosphates. To replace the recently swapped out hydrogen atom.